On today's episode of Video Marketing Madness, we're going to discuss three YouTube add-ons that make YouTube better. And in our Mindset Matters, we're going to share something that's going to help you be happier and more productive. And today's episode is made possible by Free Video Editor. If you're looking for a free video editing program so you can do all that great editing without spending hundreds of dollars, well then head on over to freevideoeditor.co where you'll be able to download our editing program and start working right away. Once again, that's at freevideoeditor.co. Leave off the last M for money. Now it makes sense. All right, mm -hmm. let's hit that music. He's Ray the Video Guy, yeah, Ray the Video Guy. His skill is where it's at, even if he's a little fat. He's filled with video expertise, and has so much knowledge that you need. His YouTube ninja tricks can make your marketing so sick. He's Ray the Video Guy, yeah, Ray the Video Guy. And if you're watching the Facebook Live, you know, I've always thought I had a fine head of hair, but not compared to Ray the Video Guy. I tell you what. That's right. And he's, he's got it kind of nicely combed today. He looks like Tyrone Power. <laughs> uh, it doesn't look like I just rolled out of bed. That's awesome. <laughs> you, you, you look good for the way you look. That's and right. it's the radio show about video, video marketing madness with Ray the Video Guy. I'm Steve Sleeper on the Earn.show radio network. And we are on YouTube and Twitter and Facebook. And just Google video marketing madness. You'll find it. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. So anything exciting happening in this week as far as uh, the world of Steve and video goes? We moved our church. But that doesn't have any. Well, I guess I, I video the sermons. So you do. Now, now, when you say you moved the church, you mean you like picked it up and, and had it moved to a different location or, or you just moved out of it? No, we, uh, we, we moved out of the temporary location we were in to another temporary location. <laughs> so there you go. Hey, it's, there's all, all, it's all in there's God's a, time, right? It, yeah, it's, there's only 100. Yes, exactly. There's only 125 of us, which is, you know, I'm not bad, but uh, well, most, most cults aren't very big. So yes, that's right. <laughs> but um, yeah, we're saving to build a church, so we and we have to look for cheap space. And we had a nice location, but the city's going to tear it down. <laughs> How appropriate! All right. Well, instead of tearing something down, we're going to talk about building something up today, and we're going to talk about some resources that will allow you to create some add-ons to YouTube so that you can make YouTube better. Now, what does that mean when I say add-ons? Now, first of all, I guess we could use the hashtag um, uh, make YouTube great again, I guess would be the uh, the hashtag for this. Make YouTube great again. So, hey, was that Donald Trump? Uh, it might have been. He was just calling. He was complaining yeah. that I was stealing his, uh, his slogan. So uh, the lawsuit is pending, apparently, already. Amazing. Well, this will help build a wall around YouTube. That's right. Build a wall around YouTube. Make YouTube great again. All right. So what I mean by that is when you go to YouTube, um, you may you may notice that sometimes there's a lot of extra steps you have to take to do certain things. You know, you go in there and you got to hit your little face button in the corner and then you got to hit creator studio and then you got to choose what you want to do. Well, with some of these, um, basically with ours browser plugins or browser extensions, it adds functionality to the YouTube page. And everything from uh, you know a resource menu that immediately takes you to your videos and to other things to being able to create, um, you know, when you go to upload and you can actually put in presets where well, you can have sets of presets. And there's all sorts of other cool things you can add on to this. And so the three products that I'm going to talk about now, two of them start off free and then you have to pay to upgrade to get some of the really good features. And the third one is one that you actually do pay up front, but it's a very low cost and, and actually has a lot more marketing functionality than some of the other ones. Now, the first one I want to talk about is one that many people may be familiar with because it's been around for a long time, and it's called vidIQ. Now, if you're not familiar with vidIQ, it adds a lot of 
information about people's videos. So for instance, when you're on the actual YouTube page, you're looking at a video, it's gonna show you a lot of the cool information like uh, you know, how many views they've got, how many likes on Facebook, how many, um, how many shares they've had here, how many comments. So it's gonna give you a lot of neat little information. And you can get that at vidiq.com. And it's a nice little plugin. Um, it works for Chrome, so it's very easy to just add into your Chrome browser. And then literally, as you're looking at a YouTube video, over on the right-hand side, and I guess we're mirrored here, so right-hand side, I guess, is over here. So over on the right-hand side, you're going to see a little chart, and the chart's going to give you how many views they have. It's going to tell you how many likes, etc. And it's just going to give you a really nice overview of that one particular video in a nice, easy format. Now, the cool thing is, if you're willing to spend some money and you're willing to upgrade this to the, to the, I don't know if they call it the pro version or whatever the upgrade version is, you can add all sorts of really neat information. For instance, they'll show you the velocity of views. So let's say that uh, you're looking at a video and it says it has 10 million views. Well, that could be very useful for you if you're, let's say, going to run an ad and you say, oh, this would be a great video to run my ad on until you find out, well, it's got 10 million views, but the last time it had a view was a year ago. And all 10 million of them took place three years ago. Well, then you know it's probably not a great one to put your ad on. And vidIQ, the paid version, will actually give you that information. It'll give a little chart and it'll show you the progress of the uh, the views. So it'll show that it's growing over time, growing over time. So if you see it growing and then it plateaus, well, then you know you know, it's, it's not getting any more views now and it's not a useful video. So, but again, that's the paid upgrade for that. But it gives a lot of great information for that and the velocity. Um, but it's definitely a program worth looking at, even for the free version. You're going to want to add this to your Chrome browser because it's going to give you a lot of cool little insights. It'll, um, like what most of these do, it'll give you the tags. Um, and for those of you who don't know, Google and YouTube, they've blocked the tags, which you used to be able to get. You'd look up a video, you'd see what tags they're using. Well, they block them now so you can't see them. And all three of these, I believe all three of them, uh, will actually give you those tags again so that you can see what other people are using for tags. So it's a very useful piece of software. And again, that's at vidiq.com, V-I-D-I-Q.com. You can check it out today, download the free version, and get started with it. I think you'll really appreciate that particular one. I sure do. Yes. Now, the next one I want to talk about is one that has a lot of different functionality and most of the oh, functionality that it wait a has. Minute. Was that was that, that Trump again? That was an update on the uh, the lawsuit for using the uh, make YouTube okay. great again, but uh, okay, we'll sorry. block Go it ahead. for now. Um, so the next one actually gives you a lot more functionality that's more uh, from a usability standpoint than it is necessarily a marketing standpoint. Although when you upgrade, there are some marketing tools in there. Now that one is called Tube Buddy, and I think mm -hmm. we may have talked about this particular one in the past before. But yeah. TubeBuddy, again, is a browser extension. Uh, this one will work on Chrome, and I know it works on Safari, and I believe it actually works on uh, Firefox as well. And what this particular one does is it gives you all sorts of great tools. So one of the tools that really makes a big difference is that uh, menu that I talked about. So when you go to YouTube, you'll automatically have a little menu right in your corner. It'll say, it'll show a little TB logo, and it'll be on the YouTube page itself. Click on that and it'll take you to all the places that usually take four or five steps to get to. So for instance, you know, if you want to get directly to what videos you have, there's a button right there on the main page of YouTube ready for you to jump right to your videos or right, right. to your channel, whatever it happens mm -hmm. to be. They put that right inside there, makes it very, very useful. Uh, it also jumps you right to your analytics and a bunch of other things as well. So you definitely want to add that in there. Now, it also gives you some other really cool built-in functions right inside of YouTube. One being the ability to create nice thumbnails. So it actually has a thumbnail builder uh, right inside the product. You can deal with annotations right from inside the product. You can set defaults. Now, YouTube itself has defaults. And what I mean by that is, let's say you've got a channel about dog training and every video you upload onto that channel always starts with, you know, uh, your website, your phone number, and then uh, 
it has, you know, you always have a bio of who you are. Well, what, what a default does is it automatically puts that into every video that you upload automatically. And then you can go in and you can just add the new information to that. Well, with TubeBuddy, you now have the ability to have multiple default settings. So for instance, let's say you've got a channel that's a little more widespread, such as um, you know, a local business directory in your town. Well, when you upload a dentist video, you can choose the dental preset. You upload a, uh, a pharmacist video, you can use the pharmacist preset, and it'll set that information in there for, for you automatically. And then you'll have multiples of these in there. So it's a very, very useful program for that. It gives you a lot of instant access to analytics. Um, you can create animated GIFs with the program. You can also do captioning with it. So just a lot of really cool functions that you can do inside this particular program. That's uh, TubeBuddy. Now, you, some of these you'll have to upgrade for. And when you do, you're going to get a lot more features, including some of the marketing features and things like that. Um, you can do you know, copying of annotations, applying templates for annotations, all that kind of fun stuff. And they even have vid to vid promotion so that you get more views, get more likes, get more shares, etc. Um, and they do it legally. And what I mean by legally is YouTube's not going to ban you for doing it. They are a partner of YouTube, so it's, uh, you know, it, it works in compliance with all of YouTube's stuff. So you don't have to worry about that. So anything in there, perfectly safe. They're a partner of YouTube, and I highly recommend you check it out, TubeBuddy. You can check it out right now at TubeBuddy.com slash RayTheVideoGuy. And this is for anybody that has a brand, uh, a network, you know, if you're an agency or if you're just a creator, you're going to find tools that are going to be very, very useful to you. So highly recommend that you check it out right away. Why not, right? Yes, Hopefully with indeed. SEO too, by the way. It, it will do, uh, it'll give you suggested tags and, ta you know, um, translations and A-B tests and all that kind of fun stuff. So there's a lot of really good SEO stuff in there and, uh, you know, can really make a big difference to your channel. So check it out. It's, it's TubeBuddy.com slash Ray the Video Guy. All right. So that's number two. Number three is something new that actually just uh, just came out yesterday. And uh, the, the product is called Tube Scout. And much like the other two, it's a browser extension. This time it is only for Chrome. And what it does is it adds marketing functionality to your, uh, your YouTube. And what I mean by that is when you go in and let's say you're searching for uh, Los Angeles plumber. You go into YouTube, you search Los Angeles plumber. It's going to pull all the videos like it normally will, except that underneath each of the videos, it's going to tell you how many views they've gotten in the last seven days, how many views they've gotten in the last day. It's also going to give you the option to download all the data, download all the titles from all the videos so that you can have this in a database, all the URLs so you can have it in the database, and it's going to reveal all the tags that people are using. And one of the cool features of this is you can actually, in with one button, download all the tags from all the videos that are on page one. So you literally, you know, if each one of those, if there's 10 videos on there and they've each got 10 tags, you can download 100 of the tags immediately with the click of a button. It's going to give you all of those things. And it'll also show you the tags underneath each video. So it's very useful there. And then one other feature it does is from the YouTube page, it's going to tell you after your search all the comments that each one has. And this can be a very, very useful feature. Um, back a while ago, we talked about Something that I do often with my YouTube channels is I will go to competitors' channels and see what people are asking. You know, uh, for instance, you know, if, if I'm doing something with plumbing, somebody might be asking, well, gee, you know, uh, how do I fix this? Well, I can go in there and I can say, hey, you want to fix that? Here's what you do, blah, 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 blah. And what happens is when you do that, people notice that and they subscribe to your channel. And I've literally many times watched you know, the little pop-up that Chrome puts up on your screen there, that, you know, right after I've commented on somebody's question on another person's video, whoop, so-and-so just subscribed to your channel. So it can be that quick. Well, what this does is this allows you to find which videos it almost instantly are going to have those comments on there. So you're going to look and you're going to see, oh, this one's got a thousand comments. There's going to be a lot of people looking for information. You click that, you go in, you answer people's questions, and you get a lot more subscribers, a lot more views. 
Now on the opposite side of that, if, if you find a video that's got a lot of views and a lot of recent views, but no comments, well, this is a great time to go in there without being spam artist here. We don't want you to be spammy, but this is your opportunity to be right front and center of everybody watching that video. So if they're getting 300 views a day right now, and you know yesterday they got 300 and in the last week they've gotten 2,100 views. Well, if you go in there and there's only two comments and you put a comment right there, you're front and center of all those people that are seeing that video but not commenting. So that's a great opportunity. You can find those in there, just look for the ones that have good views recently, find the ones that have very few comments, go in, put it in there, boom, you're gonna be right at the top and you're gonna get a lot of, you know, a lot of attention because of that. So it's very, very useful to be able to do that. Now, the other thing this one does is when you go into the, um, the actual video page, you now have the opportunity to download their transcript automatically. So you just click a button, you get the transcript, and now you've got that. You can still look at how many views they've gotten in the last seven days and in the last day. You know, Obviously, you can see all the comments. You don't need a tool for that anymore. And you can still download all the information from not only this video, but from all the videos that are suggested on the side. So all those side suggestion videos, you can see all their information as well. You can grab their information and uh, now you're able to really know not only what videos to comment on, but you're going to know what videos or what keywords bring back videos that are getting attention. So you do a search and you see 10 videos that are getting views, that could be a very good keyword. Now, one other thing it does is at the top of their, they, they put a little chart on your actual YouTube channel or page as you're looking at YouTube with some of the buttons. It also gives it a score that allows you to know whether this is going to be a keyword that's gonna be easy or difficult to go after. And so you just look at that and, and you know, if you've got videos on there that are getting a lot of views and you've got a, a competitive score that's, you know, that says you should do well with this, then that is an absolute golden nugget because you can rank on that page and you know that people are searching those terms and they're watching videos that follow those terms so you can do very, very well with that. So it's just a great product. Again, it's called Tube Scout, and you can see that at raisebonuses.com slash Tube Scout. And uh, you know, it's just a great little, great little add-on for YouTube that really adds some nice effective tools so that you can really start to dominate YouTube. So again, cool. check all three of those out because they can work in conjunction. You can have VidIQ, you can have TubeBuddy, and you can have Tube Scout. And uh, you know, some of the things in each of them may have a little overlap, but for the most part, you're gonna get a little bit of something out of all of those. So highly recommend you check out all three of those tools. And uh, you know, I told you the, the first two, Tube, TubeBuddy and VidIQ, they give you some basic functions for free. And then when you purchase, I, I, you know, I'm not sure of the exact prices, but I think, I wanna say it's you know, by the year, you pay by the year, and you know, it's not overly expensive. Uh, Tube Scout, I think right now is about $9 to add that oh. into your thing. So yeah. okay. very, very easy to do that and well worth it. Uh, you know, wow. so work. much, so much functionality to it too. I mean, yeah. That's, I mean, you can uh, you really know. turn the, the YouTube page and that's, what's brilliant about this is it's not, you know, we've seen a lot of marketing softwares that are third party softwares that will bring in videos and give you information. But when you're just on YouTube itself and you've got this information right there on the page, it just makes life so much easier. And uh, it's just cool to have that kind of stuff going on. And Absolutely. by the way, you know, this is nothing new. There's um, there's plugins for Google where you can add these things into Google itself. We've had uh, you know tools that give you the SEO competitiveness of all the of all the listings on Google. We've had ones where it helps you to know um, instantly whether that website that's showing up on Google has a video. So then you can market video to people if it's got an uh, a, a list opt in. If it doesn't, you can market to them putting list opt-ins. So there's a lot of these types of plugins that uh, are out there, but these are specifically for YouTube and they add a lot of great functionality. So I just thought it'd be a good opportunity to share those today. So there yeah, we go. And, and if you got any questions, put them in the comments section if you're watching the Facebook Live live and yes. Ray will answer. But yeah, these are neat. I've, I've long had vidIQ and TubeBuddy and uh, I'm glad to have it and for nine bucks and all that functionality, gee whiz. You know, yep. with uh, with two very scout. very good stuff. Yeah. It definitely is. 
Yeah. Okay. Well, well cool. So uh, mindset matters. Huh? Yes. Let's hit that little bumper. All right. Hold on. It's loading. Uh-oh. I forgot to switch it to the... And now, Mindset Matters. Yes. I One of these days, I'm going MP3. to remember to switch yeah. that out to the uh, MP3 so it's faster loading. Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. So for today's Mindset Matters, we've got a tool or an app, I should say, that is going to help you to be happier and it's going to help you get motivated to do the things you need to do. And... The name of this app, and I want to make sure I get this right because it actually follows a, uh, there's actually two of them, and we've, um, we've talked about one of these before, but this one is literally called Journal. Not a, very, not a very unique name, but what you're looking for and what you want to search for is, um, is you want to go in and search five-minute journal is going to be the term that you're going to want to, to, to search for. And we've talked about a, a, an older app that was literally called Five Minute Journal. Now, the problem with that app is it, it was very old and it had some issues and, and they haven't updated it. So this Sounds one is like a, me. Yeah, exactly. So this is a uh, more modern version of that. It's um, just as easy to use and uh, it works perfectly fine. And what it does is it allows you to instantly go in every day, in fact, twice a day, and you can say what you're thankful for. So the three things you're thankful for on that day, and then the three things you're going to do to make that day great. So you put in those three things, the next three things, and then you follow that up with uh, kind of a, you know, today I am, and fill out that statement. So it's not a traditional journal that you might think of where people are saying, dear diary, you know, I, I saw Mary on the bus today or, you know, it's nothing like that. It is literally meant for you to organize what you're grateful for and what you're going to do to make that day great. Now, some other features of that is you can add images to these. You can also share a special message every single day. And if you are on my Facebook, on my Twitter or on my Instagram, you'll see almost every morning I post these little messages, and they're usually sayings from somebody famous, uh, you know, some sort of famous quote that's inspirational, and I post it every single morning as I'm doing my journal. So that's the, uh, the journal, and again, uh, not a very unique name. So look up 5-Minute Journal, and you'll see it's a white icon with a 5 inside of a circle, but the name of the product itself is actually just called Journal. So it's very, very useful and can help you to be happier, be more grateful, know what you're grateful for, and get you motivated to finish the things that will make that day great. So that's Journal, available on the app stores. Does it have anything to do with a Grateful Dead? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. <laughs> I'm an idiot. That's but, okay. <laughs> but it is the radio show about video, video marketing madness with Ray the Video Guy. And I'm Steve Sleeper. On the Earn Dot Show Radio Network. And today's show is made possible by a very fine product. Freevideoeditor.co. If you're looking to start video editing, you want to do high end editing, well, who needs to pay all those high prices for Final Cut That's Pro right. and Adobe Premiere, right? They're That's fantastic right. programs, but boy, they're expensive. So if you want to get started with editing, you don't want to spend that price, head on over to freevideoeditor.co. Download our editor. You'll be able to do things like green screening and three-point editing and all that other fun stuff that uh, you know usually requires quite a bit of money to do, but you can do it right inside the editor at freevideoeditor.co. Leave off the last M for mongoose. Mon mongoose. Who? This time it's mongoose. 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 Exactly. Mongoose. So. Okay. And with uh, that, we've come to the end of another episode. I'm Ray the Video Guy with my Americana root beer. I didn't mention my, my root beer oh, yeah. of the day earlier. And, you love uh, that stuff. Yeah. It's a, you know, it ain't it's cheap. Good. I was going to send you a six-pack. <laughs> they don't sell six-packs. They sell 12-packs, like 50 bucks. Yeah, whoa. Yeah, that's real expensive. Holy mackerel. Well, with the shipping and everything. With Maybe the shipping, I'm, yes. Yeah, of course, I, I, I embellish everything. It's probably cheaper. <laughs> than that, All right. Well, until next time, I'm Ray the Video Guy for Steve Sleeper saying get out there and get to work because you know what? Everything that we talk about on this show will work for you, but only if you work for it. So get That's out right. there and do that. And we'll see you all next time. Let's hit that music. 
If play I play that funky music of White Bull. Play that funky music. He's Ray the Video Guy. Yeah, Ray the Video Guy. His skill is where it's at. Even if he's a little fat, he's filled with video expertise. He has so much knowledge that you need. His YouTube ninja tricks can make your marketing so sick. He's Ray the Video Guy. Yeah, Ray the Video Guy.